Hey guys, how's it going? The Haggard Nerd here. Welcome back to Factorio. Uh, last episode, we worked on getting our um, a new energy area situated with the new reactors and stuff, but we're still waiting on a whole lot of stuff. Um, I just realized there's some uranium there. I'm going to have to get some bots to take care of for us. Uh, but the bots are still building stuff to fully hash this area out. And once that gets built in, then we'll have a whole lot more power to work with. Uh, right now, I'm trying to focus on yellow science and trying to figure out why that's not working for us. Um, I also need to set up an, enri an enrichment area, which is uh, what this is up here to the north. So just a whole lot of stuff that needs to be taken care of this episode. And it looks like maybe I need to run red belts here. I may have to completely overhaul this area and just do it all in red belts. But yeah, it's, it's a lot of upgrading right now. Trying to trying to get everything saturated, making sure there's enough production across the board for everything. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. There we go. In Torwalk, I should have I should have installed that upgrade planner thing that you posted in uh, the Factorio channel. I meant to actually, I just completely forgot. As is tradition. Let's see here, uh, it's got a problem. Let's see where that is, that's down there. I think we're still fine. Uh, by the way, one of your pipes on the right hand set is not connected to the source. Um, are you talking about back at the reactor? Where, what, what pipe, what section of the, the the base. What section of the factory? Away with the soon TMM. <laughs> uh, back at the source of your new... Okay. I'll run over there real quick since we're right here anyway. So one of the waters... Water sections are not connected up. Looks like there's all water here. Oh, well, how dumb was that? <laughs> Thank you for that. That would have bugged me, plagued me, and I wouldn't even have known what happened. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay. Yeah, that that was a dumb mistake. Okay, so now I need to get uh, all the other things pulled in. Oh, and we're out of green, so that's that's fun times. So let's just continue working on upgrading this area because it needs it. I mean, I'm so tempted just to pause the episode right now to install that that upgrade planner thing. It's apparently, I'm going to be messing stuff up. Awesome. There we go. Okay. So we have red, red. Uh, new demands because of chain effect. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. I would expect nothing less. So we're just going to spend a few minutes here upgrading all this stuff. It'll, it'll, it'll be okay. It'll be just fine. Let's see here, that's going this way, okay. And I just realized I'm gonna have to do fast loaders here. Oh, okay, that was fun. I was like freaking out and I was running right into it. That's how I do things. There's that, okay. Let's go ahead and do fast loaders here. Oh, 
the uh, the upgrade planner thing was written by one of the developers of the game. That's kind of cool. I'm all about trying to save some time here and there. Okay, we'll worry about that stuff later. Okay, so everything that's yellow here needs to be taken care of. Have you used that mod by chance? I mean, is it pretty easy just to hop in and take care of? Because I, I literally may just go ahead and do that. I'm so tempted to do that. If you test it and you, you can tell me right now that without a doubt it works, uh, without any sort of errors or anything, I will install it right now. Cloning? Oh, okay. You've not used it yet. Okay. All right, I'm not going to go randomly install something then without having prior testing. Of course, that's just me being lazy, but I should have checked it out before. Okay, that's everything in. And then uh, stuff going out. I mean, I right know the priority is in. Are there any other inputs that are still yellow i don't think so and it looks like we're probably gonna have to go back and upgrade our green area too because that's i think what we're waiting on right now Ooh, here we go all this is still yellow holy crap how'd i miss all that because <laughs> i'm a derp that's why there's that so we got it all through there okay that's where we missed it entire section down here that I missed. Okay, let's deal with the underground. That, this down, and this down. Oh boy, that seems all correct. You installed the aircraft one first. Yeah, I, I don't know if I'm gonna get into aircraft. I that's I don't know. Being able to just to jump back and forth without having to deal with going through your base takes a it adds a layer of, I don't know, easiness, I guess, that I, I don't really want to deal with. Because, I mean, if you can just cross over everything, why not just install teleport pads, you know? Something like that. If they if they have those in the game, I don't even know if there's a mod for that. I would assume there is. Okay, so if the train with the stuff that we need here, which is electronic circuits, doesn't come by by the time we finish upgrading this, I will assume that the other area needs to be upgraded as well. So this is going to be the upgrade episode, it seems. This is fine. But I am actually tempted to still try to install that thing. So here's what I'm going to do. Here's what I'm going to do. Because it'll, it'll save time. So I'm going to save the game. And if it crashes, then we can go back to our save. Um, I, I, I saw the thing in the Factorio thingamabob. Uh, upgrade planner. Upgrade planner cloning. So if I just search, uh, I'm going to go ahead and quit. <laughs> I'm bringing up uh, the one I use, CFAN, which is great. So we can sort by, or we can search by cloning install that mod and get back into it. Of course, I could just probably have done that in the in-game mod GUI or whatever, but I prefer CFAN, which is great. Uh, K-L-O-N-A-N. And it's the upgrade builder and planner, upgrade builder and planner. Correct. Let's go ahead and apply changes and apply, install, do all this good stuff. Hooray. And we're good to go. Let's launch Factorio. There we go. There we go. Okay, yeah. So Steam Cloud was just being stupid. 
Oh, thank you, Nero. Yeah, that's that's what I should have done before. Put my immersion. Sorry, guys. <laughs> It's what I get for wanting to save a little bit of time. It ends up messing up on me. That's like how a lot of my life goes. I try to brute force th through things and try, I try to be smart about things, but it usually has to be brute force methods. Just try to hit it hard until it works. And then, um, and then, and just everything just wants to fight back against me. So it is what it is. So let's load the game. Let's watch it. Like my computer catch on fire. Okay. So now we have this thing of a Bob. Which I'm going to assume allows me to select one thing to upgrade to to that one. Because I've used something like this before. So let's go with the slow to the fast. Let's go with the splitter to the splitter. Let's do um, also the slow to the fast. Oh, and they added new express mini loaders. Nice. Okay. Um, also that. Nope that get the trash that so that to that and then is there anything else immediately i want to do i'm sure there is but for right now i'm okay rest everything else belt sorter okay um yeah that should be good should be good and then click a blueprint or blueprint book to upgrade the entities inside oh that's cool get an upgrade planning tool ha 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 Okay, so if everything works properly, I should just be able to do this. And everything turns red. Okay, now I get to save some time for you guys. Awesome! So Torvok, it works. <laughs> fast, to st fast to stack? Did I, did I click the wrong thing? No. Inserter to fast inserter. And then, oh, you're su suggesting fast to stacked. Uh, I generally use stacked. Yeah, I guess that would be the next logical step. Okay, good enough. I add things as needed, and I, I try not to be... I don't even know what I'm trying to say here. It's fine, is what I'm saying. It's fine. And I guess I could probably go ahead and do the inserters as well, right? The longs are not really going to help us out. I'm so used to having uh, five dims that had the fast long inserters. I can just do this. You know what? Just, just freaking do this, right? Insufficient items! Are we out of... Fast inserters? No, we're not. Okay. What are we out of? Why was I saying the thing? Insufficient items for something. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. I'm so happy for this. So happy for this. Okay, there we go. And then probably should be able to just kind of bunk. And blink. And blink. And blink. And blink. Ha ha! Okay, so next, then, we will work on the green circuits. Oh, I'm so excited for this. Okay. Uh, being damaged. Okay. They're really hammering that area. I'm going to have to go take care of that area soon. We have a couple of bases here in the area. I'll need to be taken out soon. Not just yet. Oh man, I need to make a whole bunch of stuff, it seems. Okay, so let's go ahead and do our upgrade planner for this guy. There, this entire area. Because of reasons. Just go ahead and select the entire freaking thing. Insufficient items. What do I have insufficient items? Oh, uh, probably the fast loaders. Let's go ahead and make all of them. Oh, let's not make all of them. Okay. Let's make them until we need stuff. And then do the upgrade thing again. So we've made a couple now. That should be that. Good. Let's do all that. Do we not have it? Oh, we, we don't have the, the red belts. Got it. All right. That's an, another thing I need to make in my mall. So let's go ahead and make... All those. No, let's not make all those. Let's go put them in the mall. That's what the mall's for. Let's make all of our... We have yellow belts. I don't think we have splitters. So we're going to have to make splitters, underground belts, and then we can make the red belts 
red splitters and red uh, everything else. So I did not saw that. One of the streamers I was watching showed me that it can teleport items, aka use the map view. Oh, I'm not looking to try to like dupe stuff. I'm trying to, uh, yeah, I mean, that's, that's like an edge fringe case where if you're like trying to exploit something, I didn't even know that thing ex existed until you just told me, so I'm not worried about it. I mean, if you're tempted to, to exploit stuff like that, then yeah, absolutely don't use it, but. Okay, um, let's go ahead and put in uh, splitters, underground belts, and we'll do the red of each. Let's do splitter first, and then this underground. And then what's it gonna need, what's it gonna take for these guys? We need fast inserters made. So let's go ahead and do fast inserters. That's the thing that's needed. And then once we do fast inserters, we can do the loaders. Then we can do the fast mini loaders. All right? Is that how that works? I think it is. So let's go ahead and do that, do that, do that. Grab all these guys. And then um, I'm just gonna do four across the board. Yeah, I mean, just don't, don't abuse it and you should be fine. I mean, let's do six here. And then with this, uh, maybe two for those. Okay, cool. So we got stuff working. How's our power situation? Power's looking so much better. Oh my gosh. Um, so let's go back down and check and see what's up with, with the yellow science again. We're still waiting on green. Green, of course, is what we're working on. So let's go back and work on the green. And then hopefully we can get our yellow science situated sooner. Okay. So it was green. Oh, that was close. So everything red here. Now we got some yellow still. I'm liking this upgrade planner. Once you told me that it was developed by one of the guys from the from the game, I was like, oh, okay, that that sounds okay to me. Insufficient items for the okay. So now the problem is, if I don't have the things on me, it's not going to work. So let's get rid of those. Let's get rid of those because that's all stuff that's going to be. Uh, taken care of by the, the construction bots anyway. So now we can go ahead and say, let's give me some reds. Let's give me some undergrounds. Let's give me some splitters. And here I'm going to say a thousand of each. There we go. Should be fine. And then there's auto trash, which I guess I should go ahead and do wood. This wood is always something I or never something I need more than a thousand of. Um, I always, I always lose track of stuff. There it is. Okay. So after a thousand, I think it auto trashes it. Right? Is that how that works? Yeah. Okay. Sure, that's fine. And then we're getting attacked again in the, oh, in that corner. Yeah, we're gonna have to go hunting soon. <laughs> F fish, yeah. Uh, I need to get more slots. Oh, I do have more slots. Okay. Oh, does it add one for each one? Okay. Good call. Good call. Um, I don't ever need fish. I've never needed fish. Okay, I didn't realize it would give me more as I went. Okay, so uh, in that case, I think stone. Stone, I generally don't need. If I ever have any iron ore, that needs to go. If I ever have any copper ore, that needs to go. If I ever have any uh, or uranium, that needs to go. This is a dark one. Uranium rubble. That's interesting. Um, yeah, I think that's good. I think that's good. Correct. Uh, it'll keep the amount you specify and trash the rest. Doesn't keep track of your logistics thoughts. 
feedback loop. Okay, so I'm not requesting wood. I'm not requesting fish or stone. I'm not requesting iron or copper. I'm not requesting uranium. So that should be fun. Okay. Cool. Everything's good. So how am I doing on stuff? Okay, I could probably go ahead and use the upgrade planner a little bit more now. Boink. 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 It's efficient stuff. It keeps telling me that. Is it because of this? Oh no, it's because I'm out of belts still. Inserters. Oh, am I? <laughs> yeah, okay. I need more logistics requester slots. Uh, I don't see any regular inserters here, though. I'm not saying that that's not a thing, but I have 259 on me currently. So that's kind of concerning. Oh, okay. I'm out of red belts again. Okay, so this area will get situated soon. What are we waiting on now? We're now waiting on copper, it seems. Okay, well, that's a thing that needs to happen sooner rather than later. Uh, the big copper stash is over here. Oh, man. All this basically refactoring, going back through and checking and seeing what's missing and where and why. I may need to increase my production of certain things. Take out the fast to stack. Oh, you know what? That's... You're absolutely right. That's why I was not considering that, but I, I was assuming that what you were telling me was, was correct, but yeah, that, that's why I generally don't do the stack things uh, automatically like that because it, it, it gives you trouble later on. Oh God, I'm just trying to cover my tracks here. I wasn't going to do it originally, and that's actually the reason why I just couldn't think about it before. Okay, so we're almost full here. This is going as full as fast as I can. And of course, if I could upgrade all this, I would, which would be helpful because we're completely saturated here. And then once I get all the stuff, then maybe I'll do that. But um, let's go ahead and ride this around. We're almost full. Let's go to check in. I used a lot of copper and stuff for the uh, reactors and stuff like that. And of course, still using it, but, but it's being used by the bots now rather than me crafting it manually. We're being attacked. Okay. And here we're still waiting on a whole bunch of stuff. I need to, I need to hand make some blue stuff, but of course <laughs> we need artillery to finish so I can unlock the blue belts. That's the big thing right now. I don't think anything's dropping off the way it's supposed to. It doesn't really matter now that I've got my mall situated, kind of. Okay, hopefully this will go to the green area. And just have to make the big loop. Of course, I need to check my bot creation to make sure that uh, we have plenty of bots in the system and bots are still being created. We are currently on episode four, and we have five going on tonight. Thanks, Dorvok. Okay, this is exactly where I was hoping it would go, which is great. And then, um, let's go ahead and check out our bots. So this is going to take a minute to process. And we still only have 14 fast transport belts. We're requesting a thousand. So let's go over here and see what's up with the bots. Okay. Bots are a little bit further down. Here we go. 
Uh, there's plenty of... These are construction bots, I believe. So plenty there. Then we have plenty of logistics bots. So not... In, we, we don't have a lot of logistics bots being requested, it seems. Okay. I think I'm going to go ahead and... Do that. Just so we'll have plenty. And that, I'm just going to leave... <laughs> Just like that, that'll be fine. So yeah, if we ever need any more logistics spots, they'll just come and pop in here and it'll be awesome. So now that we got through that round of construction and, and development of items for the map, then, you know, we can focus that effort and that creation and that energy and towards other things in the map. Looks like we're getting our red belt stuff, which is kind of nice. So I think I need to head back up to the north so I can do the upgrade planner thing again. Just go ahead and get that ready to go. I do have free bots finally. Everything finally caught up. So I don't have to worry about that too, too much. Boink. Boink. Let's try this again because I don't know if I missed anything. Boink. Boink. Okay. Can I just do this? Ha ha! Oh, I almost missed. I almost missed. The question is, can I put that there? I can! Okay! There we go. Instead of having to go back in there every single time. Um... I think that is good. Seems like it's pushing stuff out pretty fast, and we still have a little bit more. Boink. I don't see any other yellows. So that's just gonna take a time, uh, take a little while, unfortunately. I mean, we'd have to really expand this out more. We might need to do that. We might, we might need to start thinking about doing bot-based everything from here on. Okay, so once again, uh, back down to our stuff. So we're waiting on red now. It looks like. Oh my gosh. But now we're waiting on red, but we're waiting on green. We're waiting on plastic. Plastic is on its way though. How many do we have? Ah, man, this is rough. <laughs> oh, we're just starving for everything at this point. So, I mean, artillery will happen when it happens. But, um, I think next episode we're going to work towards getting all this stuff down here in this, uh, missing objects list. Because we don't have a lot of these available to us just yet. Um, so I'm going to work on trying to get those situated. And then that way we can get the, uh, enrichment area situated. And, um, we can... Reuse some of the uh, 235. Two th there's two types of uranium. There's the light one that gives you your power, and the dark one that isn't good. Ooh, almost got hit. Um, the 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 enrichment process turns the dark uranium into the light uranium. So uh, that's what we want to do, um, and we'll get that in the next episode, or at least we'll try to work towards it. So guys, if you're new here, hit the follow button. If you're over on the YouTube side, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Uh, make sure you hit that like button as well. I'd appreciate it. And guys, do me a favor. Share my videos, share my live streams, leave likes, leave comments, all that good stuff. The more you participate, the bigger you grow. Definitely want to do that. So I appreciate all the support you guys give me every single day. Thank you guys so much. You guys rock. And uh, guys, be awesome. Be excellent to each other. And I'll catch you in another video. As always, thanks for watching. Take care.